The Nigerian Football Federation and sport lovers have been thrown into a fresh round of mourning as the death of former Super Eagles defender Yisa Shofolue has been announced. Shofolue died on Tuesday, February 9, after being in a coma for five days. The 53-year-old passed away at the Lagos University Teaching Hospital, Luth, after he was diagnosed with a brain disease known as mild cerebral atrophy. The ex-defender was rushed to Luth on Friday, February 5, after his condition worsened. He was earlier admitted at the Prince and Life Medical Hospital, Ikorodu, Lagos. Ex-footballer Waidi Akoni, who had been taking care of the deceased, broke the news of Shofolue's death. Shofolue is gone. We lost him this evening. May God rest his soul. We will go there tomorrow to get his remains. He didn't make it. We tried our best to save his life, but unfortunately, he was gone to be with the Lord, an emotional Akoni revealed. Also reacting to the ex-defender's death on Tuesday night, former star player of stationary stores and friend to Shofolue, Taiwo Oloede, said, we lost a gem again in the legendary Yisa Otobo Shofolue, Minister of Defense. Rest in peace. Shofolue won 40 caps and scored one goal for Nigeria and was a member of the Eagles squads which reached the final of the 1984 and 1988 AFCON tournaments. At club level, he featured for Ibadan Giants 3SC between 1982 and 1983, winning a domestic league title before moving to Abiola Babes, where he spent four seasons and won the FA Cup twice in 1985 and 1987. After the 1988 season, he left his club Abiola Babes to play in Belgium, where he fell into oblivion. He was nicknamed the Minister of Defense by his teammates and fans due to his timely tackles and strong defensive performances.